It holds the record for having 17 of the top 20 most attended single day sporting events in the world. What is that? It has 75 million diehard fans in the USA alone. Its largest venue can accommodate 190,000 people. Think of the, the sporting places, Super Bowl, stuff like that. An estimated 4,320,000 people attend their events each year. An estimated 250 million people watch their events on TV. What is it? The National Association for Stock Car Auto Racing, better known as NASCAR. I mean, NASCAR is really the biggest sports that we have in the United States. Staggering, staggering numbers. And when you take a look at it, here's the Daytona 500. This one race in February, over 15 million people watch it every year. And if you look at the cars, advertising, advertisers, the big names of our day are on these cars. It almost guarantees that if you're on the car, you're going to get so much press, it's absolutely ridiculous. Important fact. Now think about this. NASCAR, lots of excitement, all the stuff going on, some of the thrills and spills, some of the, the sexiness of it. Oh, and, and advertising, Lowe's, DuPont, I mean, on and on. Even on the helmets. Well, why do I tell you all this? Howard Hirsch has done it again. Howard Hirsch has pulled off a really, really big one. Right now, as I'm telling you this, he's finalizing a deal with NASCAR where Turn On will be an official sponsor of NASCAR with our own car. I mean, can you imagine that? This is the type of scenario. Can you imagine the announcers when they see that black car with the flames on it and the turn on and it says a love drink? The announcers on TV, the announcers in the stands, I bet you they're going to talk about the love drink, aren't they? Because people like to talk about it. It's something that they can kind of be cute with, kind of make fun with. Imagine the people in the stands, those 190,000 people that are sitting there, imagine what they're going to do. When they see that, aren't they going to want to buy it? Can you imagine somebody setting up outside of this place and selling Turn On when they walk out of there? How many of those 190,000 people are going to buy that? I mean, just an incredible opportunity. You take a look at that logo and imagine that logo and a unique premium adult beverage sitting there on a black car. The flames, the Turn On, the love drink, incredible. This is going to bring such notoriety to us. It's just going to be absolutely amazing. What's it going to do for the distributors? It's going to make it easier for master distributors to recruit other distributors, master distributors, retail locations, and volume retailers. All the volume retailers are going to know this is going to be huge. We will be, for the next bunch of years, sponsoring NASCAR. Think about the opportunity. Right now in the United States, none of the raceways that have NASCAR races, none of them have a retailer outside of it. None of them have a bar that sells turn on. Matter of fact, in the United States, every Sunday, look at the big, big football events. None of those places have a turn-on distributor outside of it yet. None of them. Think about that. All the college towns, none of them in the bars. Nobody's buying turn-on in the bars because you guys haven't gotten out there yet. I mean, that's how new this program is, how young it is. I want you to be aware of that. I am so excited about what happened when Howard pulled together NASCAR, I can't tell you. The guy, uh, the only regret I have about Howard is that I didn't meet him 20 years ago. He's one of the most amazing people I've ever worked with. And I'm just, just loving it.